Well, I say the fucking tip is repaired. Because that's what just got me. Fucking tip. Yeah, when I tell people, specifically my clients, customers, sharpening customers, to uh, please be extra careful, I'm not saying that to you know be a smart ass or cliche or be cute i'm being dead ass serious because i'm you know i work with this level of sharpness knives every single day and i'm very careful and i still get cut all the freaking time you know why because it doesn't take barely anything to slice you open just the slightest touch and it will split your skin straight open and it'll cut you deep too so that's why it is very important to uh be extra careful and also have some first aid stuff handy always have some first aid stuff around some bandages band-aids super glue 91 percent alcohol i keep mine in a little spray bottle first thing that i did when I chopped my finger, I, I don't mean to flick you guys off, but the first thing I did was, before I even touched it with a napkin or anything, was spray it with that 91% alcohol. Cause I could see the, the steel particles and the, the oil and the dirt and stuff from sharpening, all that stuff was still sitting on the edge of the blade. So it was like a little, dark line cut into my skin that I saw before it started bleeding. So the first thing I did was spray with alcohol. Then the blood started to push everything out. And <clears throat> I am not, uh, I'm not for really any type of vaccines, but if you're messing with sharp knives <clears throat> a lot, one that you might want to be up to date on is a tetanus shot, which I recently got mine. That is, probably the one and only vaccine that I will ever get from, you know, here on out. Shit's no joke. Be careful, guys. Um, and, and know how to, uh, you know, administer first aid to yourself properly so you don't get any nasty infections or have any further issues. So, hope everyone's having a great day. I know I am. Even though I'm cutting myself, uh, still a beautiful day. So, love you guys. Jesus loves you. Stay tuned, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.